Yo, what is up guys? This is C to the A L C coming at you with another video. Now guys, I am back for War Robots Wednesdays, guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please subscribe and like it. I'm just gonna get straight into it because I know this game is gonna be kind of long because you know War Robots has some pretty long games for its average runtime. But right now, um I'm gonna try to play with my second hanger now meanwhile it is not complete you can see i just put a freedom who's are right there and a lot of the weapons are under um you know under uh under leveled and stuff like that but you can go and pause if you want to see the bots and everything but i am just going to try to you know quickly battle so let's go to Beacon Rush and I'm just gonna start it up. You know, one minute intro, that's it. That's all I need to do. <laughs> but guys, please just um try out this um try out this game. It's pretty fun, you know, and if you wanna join the clan, don't forget. Uh if you just wanna go join the clan, comment down below. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Alright, so I'm gonna jump into Ooh, I'm gonna jump in with my Hellburner. Hellburners are <laughs> really, it's, it's, I like to call it the suicide robot. Each time you activate its ability, it loses weapon, it loses um health, right? I I have a like a whole defense setup, so it could just be like walking, like you know. I really feel like the Hellburner doesn't need any weapons because it already does damage, and with these modifications on here you know got the ecu shield for plasma weapons i can go through my ansel and yeah that's really all you need Ooh, but if you time it just right especially with face shift that i have um you could actually survive for a long amount of time like, like you see right here i'm actually taking this beacon with help from my teammates too okay so i see that guy shooting at me I'm gonna take him out. Oh no 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 no! I I could just go. Ooh, whoa! That's a that that's a hawk. That's a hawk. All right. If I explode, I explode on this guy. My EC oh my ECU is gone. My ECU is gone. And I only have low health, so I'm gonna see if I can explode on this guy. Oh okay. I did enough damage. Um. Ooh, wow, there's not a lot of people here. Let me use my one of my other drones. Um, lock on and yeah, I'm just gonna go and stay here. Oh, hey, hey, bud, how you doing? Yeah, I know you realize I'm here. Um, yeah, hi, how you doing? Uh, you're not gonna get this beacon. Oh, freak! I I forgot to teleport back. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no no! Okay, okay. It's good I have another scorpion, bro. What's up, my scorpion, bro? I I was so lucky to win this um on the um you know getting it for free and everything. It was so worth it. I this is a very tricky setup, especially when it comes to the uh, scourges and sparks. Uh, but it, it does do a lot of damage, and these are like my favorite weapons. Ooh. I'm not gonna do that. All right. And my whole setups are not like um, like look at this. I'm literally just staring at him. I don't have to turn my robot in order to do damage. So it's kind of good for a moving robot as long as you can, you know, you know how to use these weapons. Um, but these are a lot of like, it is very risky though. Just need to know how to use your spark and scourge to your fullest. Um, like you need to know how to do quick switch and everything. It's 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 but it's like very um, it, it's very like that. You see, I lost my lock on already. It kind of works, but like look at how much damage I'm doing to this guy. Oh, I got the kill too. All right, and I'm dead. Yep. Oh. And the leech, just, I mean, yeah, the leech, bro. Ugh. Oh, snap, man. All right. 
I, I'm basically I, I don't have as much damage as before only have one one um one spark oh but I'm doing decent damage okay let's teleport back I think I could just scrap the robot but I'm not going to do that at all looks like this game is gonna end sooner than I thought oh okay scrapping robot right about no let, let's try this guy let's try my inquisitor he does a lot of damage okay okay wait how much damage did i receive what my my uh overdrive was activated and don't forget these are just level five automizer and um quarkers oh, quarkers oh 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 dang i know that's not quarker uh i got the name wrong oh okay the game is over just like that boom taking it out i'm awesome i, I know i am i know i am I'm gonna take a big risk right now. I'm gonna take a big risk and do another game because it's already seven minutes. So, uh, nah, you know what? I am going to make a uh, part two probably. I can maybe do that. Mm, okay. So, sorry guys. You only got to see. What is it? You only got to see three of my robots. And that's not even like the big like power maximum power i can do with these because um like like as you see here this one doesn't do a lot of damage unless there's a lot of people on the beacon right um this one does do a lot of damage as long as i can stay alive this one i think that's one of my most highest damage dealers i have on this hanger and maybe in my other hanger too if i get this well leveled up this one is very sniper it's kind of bad as a sniper it's just meant to support so i basically just put these long range weapons so that i can you know stay in the back maybe go into the battlefield and heal with my stealth because it has stealth and air support um where it can heal so basically just go there go back uh go back you know to the back of the battlefield snipe a little bit and then this one is my pure um my pure you know uh brawler but like the weapon is kind of outdated which is orkins because i had these from back in the day when i had my um griffin i remember and i got this i got this robot a long time ago and like you see here uh but i don't even know what type of weapon i could like i could put tehran on there but i don't have two other tehrans and if i am gonna get a tehran i'll have to get like like what is it three thousand um gold on it so i don't really know what i can do about that really um but you know there's other stuff like uh other weapons i can save up for components and you know it's very cool how they have a lot of stuff that you can get robots for but the only downside is like it takes a lot of time to get those robots and everything and then yes yeah, the whole jumble jumble but yeah all right guys well thank you guys for watching please just like what i said last time consider subscribing because i'm trying to get my subscribers up and reach more people so yeah please guys just subscribe and if you're not gonna subscribe just at least like and if you do subscribe like anyways comment down below if you want to try out the game or anything you know any feedback or whatever you want to comment all right i'll see you guys later this is c to the alc signing off goodbye